the format button really allows me to customize the look and feel of my Order Queen results. Much of its functionality is explained in the overview video. Here I'll demonstrate some additional features. Here I decide which test results appear by default whenever I select a test in the ribbon. It has an impact on all tests. Up to X is probably the most interesting choice. Now Order Queen shows my favorites and adds the most recent ones until the maximum number of results I enter here. Let me put this on 4. Now I mark for instance two test results as my favorites. From now on, whenever I open Order Queen, these favorites will be displayed. Together with the two most recent ones, because I have chosen to have up to four results shown in one graph. I can save these settings here. This is under my personal account. It will have no impact on how my colleagues get test results displayed on their own screen. If I have administrator rights, I can also save these format options here. Now they become the default settings for all Order Queen users in my network. If I have overruled the default settings with my own options, this is how I can restore the format settings back to the default network settings. Now a few test specific options. For audiometry, these options are self evident. Feel free to play with these checkboxes and see the immediate effect on the graph. Since I have administrator rights, I can manage the indexes here. I already have two indexes, one is the pure tone average or PTA. It calculates the averages of the thresholds at 500, 1000 and 2000 Hz. The extended PTA is the average of 500, 1000, 2000 and 4000 Hz. I can create another index here. For instance, I can create a test index for demonstration. It calculates the average of 1000, 2000 and 4000 Hz. Or yet another one. Suppose I'm conducting a study and I need an index showing the ratio between the thresholds at 250 and 2000 Hz. Now I select this option. Done. The new indexes appear in the list and are ready to be selected. Finally, if you have different connectors for different audiometers, here is the place to select one. The configure button should only be used by experienced administrators, and preferably in consultation with the distributor or with a TOC consult. Also for speech audiometry, most options are self-evident, or have already been explained in the overview video. Here also, indexes can be managed with administrator rights. There are three ways to calculate an index. One possible index is the average of scores at different presentation levels. If I enter one point twice, it will also count for two. Another possible index is a ratio of scores at two presentation levels. Roll over is an example. And finally, an index can be defined as threshold, corresponding to the presentation level which gives a score of 50%. Or any different score I'd like to use for it. Order Queen calculates this as the absolute level. 
or relative to the normal curve that comes with the speech list. I can manage different speech tests here. Set the test scoring features. Add a normal reference curve. Or set an index that should summarize this test by default.